All right, this is a 70 Barracuda comparison of an original right side fender compared to an aftermarket AMD brand. This is what it says here, fits 70 and 71. But I'm gonna show you it actually fits a 70. 71, you might have to put a little notch in it somewhere. And I'll show you that in a little bit. All right, so comparison. In the back, it looks exactly the same. Back I'm meeting underneath. All right, got a couple little dimples here and there. As you can tell, it's on my original one here. But I believe it's body worked in because you can actually see the uh, the dimples where it's supposed to be. All right, got a little brackets there for the horns. They are correct. The cutout for the square, that is correct. All right, everything is there is correct. It's pretty good on this side. As for the top over here, not too bad. Maybe the metal is a little bit uh, wider as opposed to the factory one. Did you see it? Okay, it's a little wider for sure. Other than that, that looks correct. For the inside, let's see what the inside looks like. The inside, everything looks correct. That's it. The dimples, everything is there. Hooking up in here for now. All right, the length is the same. Bed. And this has a couple of dimples. Don't show on mine only because I think there's body work on mine. But basically all the holes are there. This is a pretty good replica of the original. I'm going to show you the difference between a 70 and a 71. Okay, a 70, this here is nice and smooth. Okay, it's a nice little corner. A 71, this piece here is actually notched in. It's not in because it has that vapor fuel line coming over here and it gets screwed in here with a P-clamp. So if you have a 71 and up, I believe this should be notched down. Lucky for me this is a 70, even though it's listed as 70, 71. If I needed this for a 71, I don't know what I would have to do. I don't know if you hit this with a hammer and indent this, but uh, you see it. Listen, if you have a 71, just take a look at that, all right? That's why how you can tell this is an aftermarket. So I'm sure when people replace this, I don't know if they actually go to the trouble of bending this down unless you're uh, graveyard cars or the other uh, great companies that do restoration work. All right, but this year, this is a 70 model only, I'm gonna say. All right, like I said, double check your cars. You're gonna see this piece here is this corner is actually inverted in the other way and then there's a little p-clamp there all right otherwise it looks good all right nice fitment all the way around right up to here right up to the end the curves are the same the slots are the same right to the very end all right